It's the end of another very long week for European investors, as the stock market roller coaster shows no signs of stopping. The victims this week were European banks, their shares swinging wildly as investors fretted over exposure to bad government debt. In another attempt to steady the markets, France, Belgium, Spain and Italy have announced a ban on the speculative practice of short selling, essentially betting on certain stocks falling, thus encouraging rumour mongering, which pushes markets down. The move echoes steps taken at the height of the global financial crisis in 2008. However, some analysts believe it may not be enough to restore confidence in the long term. Unfortunately, I fear the decision won't have much impact, as we see with what's happening in the markets this morning, the banking sector is not bouncing back. So actually the risk is that the decline will carry on next week. France led the move against short selling, as data showed growth in Europe's second largest economy had ground to a halt, and rumours persist that it could lose its prized AAA credit rating. The finance minister was at pains to play down fears. I am very confident because the fundamentals in our economy are solid. They are strong because we have a diversified economy and our banking system is among the toughest in the world. Nonetheless, markets are wondering whether France and Germany can continue to underwrite the debts of troubled Eurozone countries. Italy is now the latest to show signs of panic. The Italian cabinet announced it would meet on Friday night amid calls for the speedy adoption of a new austerity package. Traders will be making the most of this weekend to have a break from the stress. No such luck for Europe's politicians.